This is Michelle Getzinger here with the Pittsburgh Your City Show, the Aspen Wall Edition, and I'm here at Luke and Mike's Front Porch. This restaurant is right here in the center of town, and I can't wait to introduce you to them. So Mike and Luke, who's Mike and Luke? Yeah, oh man, Luke would be so mad at you, because <laughs> he's the oldest, and oh, we always oh say Luke and Mike. Luke and Mike. <laughs> <laughs> Luke and Mike are my children. Uh, technically, it says Luke. Oh, yeah, you're right. Uh, yeah, I know. I had them. <laughs> For sure, I'm right. So Luke and Mike are our bartenders right now, awesome. and they are my children. And they are obviously owners as well. So let's talk about that. Mm -hmm. You are in the hardest industry mm -hmm. to stay in business, and you've mm -hmm. not done one, but two successful restaurants. What's, mm -hmm. what's the secret? Well, this is Billy's 11th. 11th. So he's part of the secret. <laughs> and he knew, yeah, <laughs> he knew this would be a great location. And the secret is just working hard and showing up every single day and every single night. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so this your life is a little bit on the back burner a lot of times. Yeah, business comes first. Yeah. All right, here it is. Okay, so here we go. Dun, dun, dun. Thank you. Yes. All right, well, tell us a little bit about what we get going on here. All right, well, you have in front of you uh, an ahi seared tuna okay. over freshly sliced avocado with a honey soy drizzle, fresh pickled ginger, and some sesame seed. Wow. And then Sherry has in front of her some local heirloom tomatoes, lots of bright colors topped with burrata, which is really creamy, delicious mozzarella t inside of another mozzarella, like wow. so double the fun kind of. How do they make that? They pull it and then they stuff it with more like kind of ricotta style mozzarella and then form it into balls and set it aside. Wow. And then the balsamic glaze with the fresh basil on top. It's just kind of a great end of the summer. Here's your last kiss of fresh tomatoes, basils, all that stuff from your garden. It smells so good. It is. And then I have in front of me, we have some blackened shrimp over an Asiago risotto, which is just hands down our fan favorite all year long, every year. Yeah. People, it's a small bite, but people want it as a dinner with a salad. Mm -hmm. It's just a huge fan favorite. Awesome. Yes. So what inspired you to come up with these? Because you're the, you came up with these dishes on your own, right? I did, yeah. We like to do big, bold flavors, fresh, seasonal, what's available. I love to talk to the people who sell me the food to see what's in season and what looks great. And uh, then we create the menus from their, you know, recommendations of what they have and minimal ingredients, just big, bold, great stuff. Yeah, that's awesome. Yeah. Try it. Yes. Yeah. So I'm here with Lou Curcio. He is the manager here at the front porch, and he's gonna tell us a little bit about why Aspen Wall is so special. Well, it's really cool, Michelle, because of the fact that it's one of the, I think, few towns left in America that still has that strong community feel. Everyone knows each other, everyone looks out for everybody. It goes back to that old saying, it takes a village to raise, to raise a child, and everyone looks out for all the kids here. You see them playing down at the park. You know, it's really a strong community feel. Yeah, and so you started off not too far from here, right? Yeah, so actually my father uh, worked for Billy Rice, who's one of the owners, when he had Hamfels, which was one of the most prominent restaurants on this side of the river in the 70s. And that's through that contact. My dad worked from 1979, I met Billy. And then from that, when Billy opened up here, um, I started day one, which was January 24, 2011. So we're coming up here on our 10-year anniversary. Wow! And, uh, Congratulations! It's, yeah, thank you. It's just That's pretty. Awesome. It's pretty cool. Like it all comes full circle. Yeah, you know? it does. Yeah. It does all come full circle. Yeah. Well, thanks a lot for your tour and everything. Yeah, I appreciate. It. Yeah, anything you guys need. Awesome. Welcome to Aspen Wall.